Welcome back, Ohana. Let's get our caffeine on. Welcome back Ohana, or if you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Thomas and this is Stitches Ohana. So in today's video, we're gonna do some mystery pins from the park. Um, when I was at Disneyland last, I was able to pick up a few bags of the larger mystery packs. Uh, these packs usually come with five pins and the series usually has about 16 different pins. Uh, this one has 16 pins. So. The series we are opening today is, let's call this the Latte, Disney Latte Mystery Pins, okay? So, um, like I said, each pack comes with five randomly, pi uh, randomly picked pins. Um, there are 16 various pins to get. I have two bags, so the most I can get is 10 out of the 16, okay? Let's just hope we don't get duplicate bags. Now, instead of having to hold it up to the screen, I will put a picture right there so you can follow along as I read through which options we might get. So, starting at the top left, we have, looks like Minnie, then Dumbo, Cheshire Cat, Belle, uh, it looks like Sorcerer Mickey, Donald. That looks, it looks to me like Lilo and Stitch, but it could be Moana. Um... But because this is Stitch's Ohana, let's say it's Lilo and Stitch. We have Ursula. We have Bambi, Tinkerbell, uh, 101 Dalmatians. Let's say it's Pongo. We have Figment. I believe that's Figment. We have Olaf. Uh, I believe that's Rapunzel. Pinocchio. And then Hades. So, honestly, I would love any of these. These look pretty nice. Um, everyone likes a latte. So um, let's go ahead and open up bag one, see what we get. Okay, here we go, bag one. Now let's see who we get first. Ooh, okay, so these are also individually wrapped in blind bags as well. So okay, uh, double, the, uh, double the mystery. Uh, it seems kind of wasteful to me, but you know, it is what it is. Okay, so number one. We got, ooh, we got Figment, okay. So Figment is part of the Walt Disney World Park. It's not part of Disneyland. So I don't have much background on Figment, but this is a gorgeous pin. I know for a fact that Brayden of Magical Disney Pals would love this pin. So this might have to sneak in in some magic mail or something just for Brayden because um, I don't really collect Figment. And you can see, this is a fairly large pin. I mean, I mean, don't get me wrong, I got short little stubby fingers, but this is a fairly large pin and it is gorgeous. It's well done. I like the, the art on it. It's colorful. It's really nice. Pin number two. We got Pinocchio. See, these are just really well done. I like these. You can see the feather here in his hat. He's got his little blue bow. And even the middle of the, the cup looks almost wooden and marionette-like. Okay. Bag number three. Okay, let's see. Who do we get? We got... Oh, yes. Okay, we got Sorcerer Mickey. Now, I, I love Sorcerer Mickey. I love the Fantasmic show. I know a lot of people, when I opened up the Fantasmic Wishables uh, recently, a lot of people had some really great stories about what Fantasmic means to them. Um, and just Fantasmic is just a fantastic show uh, full of music and characters and just, it's just it's awesome. I love it. I'm so happy it's coming back to the parks now that things have kind of like Things are opening up slowly and slowly, but Fantasmic is finally back as as well as the World of Color, I believe, in California Adventure. So we're gonna have to plan a trip soon, uh, probably next year in early, maybe February or March. Um, let's see how things look then. But it's gonna have to happen soon, in the next six months for sure. Okay, pin bag number four. We got Mini. Okay, again, I don't collect Mini. This is not one for me. Um, it is a nice cup. It's a classic uh, 
Fab Five character, but I'm just not a mini fan. So, uh, it looks like a lot of these so far are going to be up for traders or potentially Magic Mill gifts. Because uh, I do know someone who likes mini. I like. I know someone who loves Figment. So, right now, uh, the only one that's a keeper for me is Sorcerer Mickey. Okay, final pin in this bag. We got... Ooh, Hades. Okay, this is another keeper for me. I love Hades. One of my favorite villains. Oh, and blue is my favorite color. The detail on this. Let's see if I can get the... There it is. The little skullish thing right there. You can see the blue flames underneath it. Oh, that is just awesome. Love that one. Keeping Hades for sure. Okay, bag number two. Let's do, 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 do. open that up. Pour out the pins, the little babies. Okay. Bag number one from bag number two. Let's just hope not a duplicate bag or at least not a full duplicate bag. That's like the worst. When the whole bags are both duplicates 100%, it's just horrible. Okay, we got, oh, Ursula, yes. Another one of my very favorite villains. You have the, uh, the shell there that steals Ariel's voice. You have her tentacles at the bottom. Great pen. Another one that I'm going to be keeping for myself for sure. Okay. Bag number two. Ooh, I see the the glare coming down right here. Uh, the sun's starting to go down, which means I need to hurry up. Okay. Uh, pin number two. We got... Oh, another mini. Okay. Ugh. I mean, I'm not... Ugh, but just... Ugh. <laughs> I'm sorry for all you mini fans out there. She just does nothing for me. Nothing for me. Okay, pin number three. Dumbo, we don't have Dumbo. I saw the feather. We have Pinocchio with the feather. This is Dumbo. And I know Dumbo is Kelly's, or one of Kelly's favorite uh, characters. So this might be snuck in with Figment. You know, one for each. You know, we might, we'll have to see. They might get something for me. Okay. Pin bag number four of bag number two. Rapunzel. Okay, I love Rapunzel. One of my all-time favorite of the new generation of princesses, along with Tiana. Love Rapunzel. Great pin. Um, I don't really collect her in pin form so much, so that might be a traitor. Um, I haven't really decided. I'm not. I mean, it's it's an okay-looking pin, but we'll see. Okay, finally, last pin for the day. We got Pongo or one of the 101 Dalmatians. Um, I'm not a big uh, 101 Dalmatians fan or a Disney dog fan in general, but I do know a channel, Life Joyfully Done, who loves the Disney dogs, so this might be going to them. Um, I need to figure out if they like Minnie or Pinocchio as well, but um, that might be going to them as well. That is it for me today. I hope you enjoyed this latte mystery Disney pin unbagging. Uh, this was a lot of fun. These pins are super gorgeous. Again, some of these are going to be uh, magic mail items for some channels, and some are going to be up for trades. If you're interested in trading, hit me up. My Instagram is below. You can click on the link and DM me your traders, and we'll talk some trades, okay? If you like this video, please make sure you give it a big thumbs up and leave me a comment below letting me know what you thought of this series. Personally, I think they're gorgeous. They're good size, they're well done, colorful, and they really um, showcase each character they're trying to represent. Um, if you haven't already, please consider joining the Ohana. We would love to have you. We do a lot of fun stuff on this channel from unboxings to reviews, pins and wishables, and everything else under the Disney and Harry Potter sun. Also, make sure you hit that bell notification so you can be notified when I upload more magical content just like this. Okay, have a great rest of your weekend. I will see you next time. But until then, always, always, always remember that we are Ohana and Ohana means family. Bye.